what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here we're going to talk about faces of death in this video here today so faces of death is getting a reimagining well it's already been shot i think this was shot early last year and we now are waiting for a release date at this point there aren't too many plot details out there so i figured i'd go over the rumored stuff and the confirmed details so for starters the stuff that we know to be true is that dacre montgomery barbie ferreira josie tota charlie xcx jermaine fowler and Aaron Holiday are all cast in this film. The new plot, according to Bloody Disgusting, revolves around a female moderator of a YouTube-like website whose job is to weed out offensive and violent content and who herself is recovering from a serious trauma that stumbles across a group that is recreating the murders from the original film. But in the story prime, but in the story prime for the digital age and age of online misinformation, the question faced is are the murders real or fake so that's literally all we know about this upcoming reimagining and of course to answer your question there are the videos are the murders real or fake these murders are very real this movie is a slasher i haven't watched that original movie in quite some time i just remember some coroner showing a collection of reenacted kills that is not what this reimagining is going to be like someone again has taken that original film and they are the ones acting out these murders or these kills that you see in that original film and what's funny is it does sound completely like urban legend in the wake and i say that's funny because i've heard that's what the movie is like urban legend meets scream 4. so this new film is expected to be a slasher film but not a whodunit which you've seen me tweet out on my twitter profile think michael myers jason Voorhees, freddy krueger chucky any of the iconic killers leatherface and how we know it's them right from the get-go but it's still a slasher this is what you were going to have with faces of death the killer does not wear a mask to my knowledge uh barbie stars as this girl named margo who has this trauma that was described above and that trauma is related to a viral video that seemingly inspired her to take this role at kino and to make things clear kino is the name of the youtube like website described in the plot above Josie Tota stars as a character named Sammy, I believe. Sammy is a TikTok influencer. Jermaine Fowler stars as the manager of Kino. Aaron Holiday stars as Margot's roommate and friend who was a horror fan and owns the original Faces of Death. Charlie XCX has a small role, so I wouldn't expect anything too grand from her in this movie. Now, Dacre Montgomery stars as Arthur, a seemingly charming man who works at this phone company. Arthur is our killer during this movie. This movie has been described as again a blend of screen four with urban legend more so it's definitely inspired by what we got in screen four going into Ar arthur's motives and all of that stuff obviously that's not really necessary because the film isn't out yet but i've been told there's some spins on this so for anyone thinking that this is just going to be jill roberts all over again i don't think they're really going to commit to it a hundred percent in that same capacity but it's going to be very clear that this is inspired by Scream 4. It's going to be made very apparent just from what's happening. The plot alone makes it apparent. The fact that uh, the killer is going after these social media and famous people makes it all very apparent. The motives are spun a little bit from what I've been told. I do like what they are proposing for the motive for Arthur in Faces of Death. And it seems to be commentating on the desensitization of Gen Z and just anyone in general who engages with constant material like this, maybe even on websites like LiveLeak and, you know, all of these other sites where you see these very deranged, heinous videos, especially LiveLeak. If you remember that site, when I was in middle school and high school, that site just somehow always ended up on a friend's computer and it would be the strangest video of someone being beheaded someone doing all of this weird stuff and you would think these videos are fake but no they're real so faces of death definitely seems to have a theme of commentating on america's desensitization and arthur is going to be the lens in which this is explored so you guys can let me know what you think about all of this down in the comment section below are you looking forward to faces of death why or why not does this sound interesting to you does it sound boring there's a lot of stuff that it's, i still do not know about this movie and again these are just rumored plot details none of this is confirmed until it starts coming out from someone involved with the production however they still have not even announced who is distributing this movie from what i have heard new line cinema 
might be one of the people distributing it or could be the sole company distributing it. We'll just have to wait and see. But I've heard that the film has great performances. I've heard that there is one very specific or one very suspenseful sequence specifically that should be very crowd pleasing. I've heard that Barbie gives a tremendous performance. She even has a moment similar to Sydney Sweeney's last sequence in Immaculate where she's covered in blood and screaming. So apparently Barbie gets to showcase her talent in that capacity, which I can't wait to see if I consider how she was pretty much so an afterthought in Nope. I was excited to see her in Nope, but then she kind of was just there and gone. She really served no purpose other than to just show that they had more than one employee. <laughs> But you guys, again, let me know what you think about all of this down in the comment section below. Are you looking forward to Faces of Death? Why or why not? If you haven't already, of course, make sure you subscribe. Turn on post notifications so you can never miss a video. In the description, I'll have links to all of my social media accounts. I am on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me in there. In the description, I'll have links to all my social media accounts. I am on Facebook, like Twitter, Twitter, and Instagram. In the future, and with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video. In the future, and with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.